Another spoiler, we're just hitting off the high, all the high edges of the epoxy on our bottom body kit and on the bumper cover, just, you know, to save us some time instead of doing it by hand. Uh, just You just want to hit it all down with a DA if you're comfortable with it. Get it all flat. You know, don't stay in one spot too long because you're going to start to cut the body kit down because it's fiberglass and 80 grit cuts through it pretty quickly. So we're just getting it down nice until we're left with a little U-shape area inside. Then we're going to actually go over with more epoxy with our finger. Then we're going to actually finish it off with our finger going in there so we get that nice U-shape. So as you see what I'm doing here with the side skirt, the side skirt was a pretty, you know, wasn't the flattest side skirt. So what I did was put a fresh 80 grit on the DA and then I just kept it flat and went back and forth on it and you were able to see the high and low spots. So as you see the white area is the high corners of the body kit and as you see the, the dark areas that's all the low spot in the bodywork. So you just want to go over it, f see your high and low spot. Sometimes if you sand out long enough, you're gonna, it's gonna start to level out because this, you know, is a very minor ripple. But we wanted to get it nice and straight because you know, you're gonna be able to see that in the reflection of the body kit when it's nice and gloss and painted. So we just tried to flatten it out a little bit, and then areas that were too bad, too low, what we did was we're going to put some putty over it, a skin coat of putty, then sand it down so we could fill it. Alright, so just wanted to give you a preview on this. Uh, in the VIP course over at LearnAutoBodyInPaint.com, uh, we get you know, a ton more in-depth, show you so much more. Um, and this is how body work is done. You know, every project is unique. You may have a project similar to this or totally different. But here, what we're doing is molding in uh, the rear spoiler into the body. We're using a special kind of epoxy here and that bonds to metal and plastic and fiberglass. And we're molding it all in together to look like one piece. Wait till you see this thing when it's done. It looks really, really, really nice. Um, so don't forget to check out learnautobodyandpaint.com right now. I'm giving away a free 85 page auto body and paint manual that you could basically take and use as your cheat sheet guide, you know, when you're working on your projects. And check out the site. There's a ton of blog posts, a ton of videos. And if you want to get expert status and go crazy, check out the VIP course. We have thousands of members worldwide. And I think you're really, really going to like it. This is an old clip, an old project that we did. Uh, we have tons more projects uh, inside the course that I think you're really, really going to enjoy. Uh, much better video quality and, and all of that. And we're continuously adding new videos and products and every single year. So again, it's Tony. Thanks for watching the video. Please like, share, and I'll see you inside.